Hello everyone, we are glad to have you back. The fourth episode of Shogun, The Eightfold Fence, unveils further details about Lady Mariko's mysterious past. After the dramatic conclusion of Shogun Episode 4, Kashigi Yabashige, John Blackthorne, and Lady Mariko understand they are going to be in for an all-out war with Lord Ishido Kazanari and would face a fierce retribution. Throughout the entire episode, which is set in the fishing village of Ajiro, Blackthorne learns more about the shrewd and seductive Mariko. Yabashide's men were to be taught Western battle tactics by Lord Toranaga, who had given the order at the end of Shogun Episode 3. Toranaga's heir, Yuki Kira, left his untrustworthy son Yashiai Nagakado in charge and took matters into his own hands by attacking Ishida's messengers with great violence. The consequences of such a hasty and calculated move, which might have been a component of Toranaga's grand scheme to seize power in medieval Japan, are instantly understood by Lady Mariko. In episode 4 of Shogun, Mariko starts talking to Blackthorn about her difficult past as the show briefly flashes back while providing little background information. In the moment, Mariko remembers tumbling into the snow during a blizzard as a young girl and seeing her father's horrified face. She tells Blackthorn that a great injustice had stolen everything from her many years prior to the events of Shogun which led to the dissolution of her family's established house. The novel and 1980 miniseries that served as the basis for the 2024 television series claim that Mariko's father murdered a daimyo in Japan, thus dishonoring his entire family. Instead of performing seppuku, Mariko was forced into marriage to Buntero, who had given his life previously in the series. In Shogun Episode 4, the show hasn't gone too far into uncovering Mariko's family's true history. Furthermore, it's unknown how much of her past will be included in the remaining episodes of the season. Like many of the characters in Shogun, Lady Mariko is based on a real person who played a role in the Tokugawa Shogunate's ascent at the beginning of the Japanese Edo period. Hasekawa Gracia, whose father Eikchai Mitsuhide killed and betrayed his lord Oda Nobunaga, served as Mariko's real-life inspiration. After Nobunaga's Avengers, Toyotomi Hideyoshi and Tokugawa Yasu defeated Mitsuhide at the Battle of Yamazaki. Hasekawa Gracia was consequently kept in captivity in Osaka. If Shogun is an accurate representation of this period in history, Toranaga is well aware of her father's massive treachery. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.